This video will look at how to output the files required to run the machine or saw via the various NC links. The NC link and process will vary depending on the user's purchase license option. Before running the NC link, it is important to note that panel drawings need to have been created and be up to date. A warning will be given if this is not the case. To begin, go to the output tab in the ribbon, enter NC output menu and choose the appropriate link. The create transfer files dialog window will open, which will list the panels along with the data such as their profile thickness and length and the description. The status field is a great way to quickly check if a panel drawing is out of date as a star will be in this column if it's not up to date or is missing. You can then go back to the project and update these before proceeding. To actually create the transfer files, simply select the checkbox of the items that need creating, then hit the select button. Now click right output. Any errors in connection will also appear in a separate text file that you can then review. A file name will appear in the appropriate column to show that it has been written. To open and check any file, simply check the box next to the file name and click open. The file will open in the appropriate program. Files can be removed in the same way. To actually transfer the files to the machine, in Windows Explorer, go to the project's root directory. The NC files will then be in the relevant NC output folder, which will be different depending on your machine manufacturer. Simply take this folder and place on a USB drive to transfer to the machine. Please refer to the machine manufacturer's instructions on how to add these to the machine itself. This concludes our video on the NC output. Thank you for watching.